welcome back to another adventure. I'm out with Paige on our first canoe trip together of the season. We're in the uh, north end of Algonquin and we're out for four days, three nights. We picked the hottest week of the summer. It's about 39 degrees with the humidity today and uh, it's forecasted a thunderstorm tonight and probably many times over the course of this trip, so we'll see. Should uh, be an interesting trip in terms of weather. skipped about half of that portage by wading and lining up the river so that was nice but not necessarily any easier and there is a storm rolling in I think so uh, we're gonna try to get back on the portage and then keep going from here. You can hear the thunder. The storm is brewing. Hopefully it's We've got a nice uh, camp spot here. Got the tent set up over there, I'll show you in a second. Put up this tarp quickly as well because uh, it started raining and thunderstorming just as we were getting to our site. It's getting dark, so I'll show you around the site quick. It's pretty big. Got the uh, tent over here. We brought Paige's old uh, Camper 2, I think, or something like that, an MEC tent. Hopefully the fly will last and it's still waterproof. It's an old tent but uh, she sprayed it last summer. Should be good. Then we got the tarp set up right on the edge of the fire. How was the swim? It was really good. Yeah. I feel so much better. We're enjoying watching these thunderstorms as the sky lights up. We can just hear it. It's uh, pretty nice right now. The fire and the lightning in the background. And no rain here yet. But the winds just changed and they're blowing in. We're probably going to get rain. So we got to cook our food quickly on the fire. Uh, enough sipping whiskey and relaxing. doing a super simple dinner tonight. I've got some smokies. Paige has some veggie sausage and uh, we're just roasting them on the fire and we have some buns and that's it. Doesn't always have to be fancy. Not quite it. Not you have coleslaw. Right, okay, wait. You have coleslaw. <laughs> Gotta get your greens. Mm -hmm. That smoky flavor. Gonna be good. We forgot uh, most of our condiments though. <laughs> Just ketchup. Just ketchup. We have mustard. Yeah. And taco sauce. So we're gonna, yeah, and taco <laughs> sauce. So we're gonna put taco sauce and mustard on these. It's gonna be really good. And cheese. And cheese. What's going on, Paige? <laughs> it's raining. <laughs> Keep roasting. You can't stop. Oh, yes. You look good. I'm gonna wait under the tarp. Oh, that must be nice. Do you want to grab the food and the cheese so it doesn't get soaked, please? Yeah, I can do that. Our gourmet sausages are done. It looks delicious, doesn't it? Mmm. With some coleslaw. Morning. We have a special visitor on our tent. Hello, Mr. Tree Frog. <laughs> 
still very humid. That's why my uh, camera lens is fogging up in here. Didn't even sleep in my sleeping bag last night, just laid on top of my mat. That was it. Very warm. Yeah, the frog is liking the humidity. And hopefully he's eating the little bugs in between the tent and our fly. Last night, uh, with all the rain that was going on, we thought well, Paige's idea was to string a clothesline underneath our tarp uh, so that we could keep airing out our daytime clothes because they were pretty wet and stinky from all our hard work. A few portages later and we're on a small high elevation lake. We're gonna have lunch here. It's very hot and humid. That's why we have our life jackets off. Dried otter poop everywhere. <laughs> yep. I just noticed. And there's wolf poop there. We stopped here at the portage. I'm making some salami wraps with mustard. What do you have, Paige? Peanut butter jelly. This was peanut butter powder, and I added water to it. It's pretty good. Hi, Alec. We are waiting on shore because there's been a lot of thunder very close to us. And I haven't been filming much with the other camera just because uh, it's been raining so much. It was a long, rainy, wet, humid, and fairly hard day. We did just over or just under seven kilometers of portaging. A lot of it was unmaintained and covered quite a few kilometers paddling as well. And yeah, it was a long day and very rainy. And lots no of fish. And no fish. I think the uh, weather kind of spooked them. That's okay. We're in the tent, ready for bed, and we're finally dry after many hours of being soaked. We'll see you in the morning. Good morning. We are drying everything out, and we were hoping that it would be a drier day, but as you can hear, the rain's starting again. I'm just in my boxers right now, just trying <laughs> to get my uh, shorts to dry a bit. But I don't know, it might be another soggy, wet day. Got some coffee, oatmeal. So everything's okay. Everything's okay, mm -hmm. and it's warm. 
not cold rain. made it over to the river and now we're going to be heading downstream on the river. All the portages are done for today. We just finished two back to back. We stopped here for a little lunch break and uh, yeah, can't get over the size of this big white pine beside us. It's huge. Pretty massive. Probably the biggest tree of the trip so far. Paige is pumping some water right now or drinking. She's already ate. I'm just here. I'm going to probably make a wrap to salami. The weather's changed. It's nice blue skies out right now and the sun is out which is awesome. Feels good to be on the river. No more portaging today and we're going downstream with the current so it's nice and cruisy. And you never know what the next bend is going to bring. Maybe a moose, beaver, muskrat, or just a red-winged blackbird. No water. No water. Oh. Ooh. Where did it go? We made it to camp for the night, and the highlight here is this. Uh, these lazy boys, natural lazy boys, that the park staff must have made with some chainsaws. Pages and mine, which my foam pad fits perfectly in. Ah, not too bad.
noceums. There's so many noceums right now. All of my legs. Ha ha. Make you go crazy. Well, it ended up thunderstorming more last night. Just after dark, the thunderstorm started. We ended up eating our dinner under a big uh, white pine tree just over there while the rain was coming down pretty hard. Throughout the night, it was raining off and on a little bit and we heard one big tree fall and we could hear the beavers slapping their tails throughout the night too. Everything's pretty wet. Yeah? Mm -hmm. But that's okay, it's our last day. So you really don't care about things Just being wet. Stuff everything in the bag and go. Yeah, exactly. Time to pack up, eat some quick breakfast, drink some coffee, and we'll be out of here. Not broke trout, little suckers. Very small. Leaving the river and we're entering the last lake of the trip and we have beautiful weather now and a tailwind so a great way to finish. Thank you for joining us on this adventure. If you want to see more Alec on adventures please be sure to subscribe. Thanks for watching!